sweet. $50,000. Ooh, that is a jewelry box. Welcome back to Treasure Anyway, Jeebus guys, and you know what? We left the house. We went into the dead zone, the crazy world that's exactly the same as it was a week ago. And we bought ourselves a storage unit. We only paid $90, it's only a five by five, but for 90 bucks, we had to get something. If I have to sit in the house doing nothing for one more day, I'm gonna go literally insane. Let's see if we can make some money. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new. Let's do it. All right, let's see what we got for 90 bucks. First little bag right here. This is, well, this is mail. Not what we're looking for. And this is all, actually, it looks like just, Yeah, brand new school supplies, look. Wow. Sharpies, pens, mechanical pencils, markers. We definitely add it to that. Ooh, look. Oh, we'll nice. We'll use this for our live auction. <laughs> live auction this Saturday, guys, it's gonna be a good one. Brand new school supplies, that's pretty much all that's in there. That's not a bad bag right there. I got this, I don't really know what the picture is, but it's a super nice frame even though it's broken, but why is it so taped up? I feel like something's hidden in here. You always see it on movies, right? They always hide stuff in a picture frame. Let's see if we can get that lucky. Open, open, and well, ooh, cardboard. What are they hiding in here? <laughs> They're hiding the picture. All right. Well, all right, nothing of interest. This bag seems to have, well, a lot of personal paperwork. And what's these? What is that? Keep it simple, guys. Okay. <laughs> like life right now. Keep it simple. It's not the crazed pandemic, pandemic black flag the media wants you to believe it is. Relax, guys. Another keep it simple. And well, more paperwork. That's not good. Let's pull out Safeway here. What? This is a bag of bags. Yay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you know what? We'll take these to the flea market. That's what we use them for to get people bags. So I don't even get mad when I see bags of bags anymore. Let's see what's in this one here. This is, well, everything's Dollar Tree. That's not necessarily a good thing. But look. It's all brand new stuff. It's just more brand new school supplies. In a fishing reel. <laughs> a random fishing reel. Remember when we had our last auction, somebody popped in and said, any fishing reels? I know. I guess what? we might have one now. We can put that in there. Yep. Well, let's see what's in here. This is a 2020, 2020 calendar. And more random school supplies, so more of the same. Let's go into this one right here. Paperwork. Paperwork and honey. <laughs> Great combo. These are all brand new picture frames. Look at this. Wow. One, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine. So far, very Ten. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. Ooh. A random oh, horseshoe. In the middle of that. I don't know. But a horseshoe. Ten brand new frames. Let's see that if might be a good auction me. item, depending on what is in the middle of that. Depending on what it is family where our stories begin and well other than that just more more paperwork you know who's creating this craziness in the world right now not the camera necessarily <laughs> but everybody that's going out and going crazy and buying all the toilet paper and buying everything to where nobody else can eat nobody can even wipe their own butts no more it's you be this is crazy okay part of my french i've never seen anything like this in my life this is wild, crazy. I just, it's hard to believe for me. It's hard to believe people are really going this crazy over something like this. Let's see what's in this white bag and this Safeway bag. Well, this Uber looks like, ew, paper and wraps. This one looks like, hey, hey look, Friskies. Hey. We found cat food. Well, that's a little expired. dangerous. That's by October 2021. They'll be happy. That's just in there. It's nice. <laughs> and well, that's pretty much all that's in there. And there's salt. Woo. Let's see what's in. Big salt. Oh, well, good job. Um, Way to go. Put on this side too. It's not even a bag. It's just a black 
covering. But this clothes look brand new. Basin. Look at this. I mean, only seven bucks, but brand new with tags. Mm -hmm. Nine bucks, brand new with tags. Stickers. Oh, uh, that's not. Well, <laughs> mm, I think I can rock that. <laughs> Little suit top. See what this is. Uh, it has like multiple things inside the jacket. Yeah, just clothes though. Yeah, if it's something interesting, we'll let you know to recap. I don't want to look at clothes. Every time you got to go into a store right now, <laughs> this is what it feels like. The adventure <laughs> begins. We got to start looking for toilet paper ahead of time because there's still none. <laughs> this is crazy. Ew. Trash. Is this trash? No, oh, it looks like trash to me. Why do they have so many, like, look, all these are Starbucks things. Whoa. Ooh. Instant it's issue debit card, instant issue debit card, temporary, temporary. Well, um, they have to, oh, Pete's Coffee things. We gotta look at these. They might be, like, different names. Might have a criminal or they might be gift cards. I don't know if they sell this kind of things, but that looks like pretty much trash. All right, we'll bag of trash out. Let's see what this one is. This is? What is this? Did I pull the trigger? Oh, look! Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh this is worth it right here what is that though like what is uh, it for what does it it's say to play with your cat cat paw that's what we're gonna use it for okay uh let's see what else is in here paper paper oh, they got on quick. what are these look oh these cat Pictures of the cat. These are all pictures of somebody else's cat. What if it's their cat? I don't know. Whoa. Uh. I'm gonna set this out. Hold on. Um. What's that? What are these? Mm. Enjoy the moment. Mm. Something's in there. Um, it's like screws. You see that? Right. Kind of random. Hey, look. Oh, cool. I'm keeping that. In my pocket <laughs> right now. Well, glasses. Authentic casino play cards. Oh, from the Golden Nugget. <laughs> and well, the rest of it's just papers again. Let's see what's in this bag now. I was about to rip it and feel strong, but I couldn't. It wasn't going anywhere. Well. Yeah. It's like more brand new stuff though. Oh, yo, yo. Mm -hmm. You want to see how good I am? Yeah. Watch this. You didn't know, I actually used to be state champion of yo, -yo. <laughs> I've actually never used a yo yo one time in my life, so let's give it a try. Bull oh, crap. Right? Never? Uh. <laughs> uh. Let me give you a little walk the dog action. Uh. Oh. No. Oh. Okay. I'm not a yo yo person. But we got a yo yo? And flipboards and whiteboards. Brand new again. Right. Something weird is going on with the news. I can't wait to find out the backstory. But look at one of these envelopes. It's all pictures of cats. Like, no joke. Look. It's just pictures of random cats. All the way through. Hmm. And dogs. And that person. Uh. <laughs> I really want to know the backstory. This is very strange. Next one, let's see. Well, this is that is hair. Oh, cool. All right, bags of hair. And another thing of hair. And well, another thing of hair. And you never guess what else is in there. Another thing here. More hair. Yay! I love finding human hair. Not really, but it sells. So we got this. is also brand new. Uh, Artist logo, it looks like pretty much a canvas. It says two piece in it. Oh yeah, there's two. So two brand new canvases, probably not really much value, but it's there. And then we got this bag here. What, ew, what does that smell? Uh, I'm scared. Ew, that's like old coffee. Yummy. Mm. Mm. You know what? I don't think I want to put my hands in that one. Pillow, pillow. Blanket. Those are some boxes at least in the back corner. First, write your own story, guys. Write your own story. 
and that's all. Beauty supplies. And jelly. Huh? And jelly. Is there jelly? Where? The bottom right oh, corner. Oh, yes. And we get jelly for, <laughs> I guess that's using beauty too. So we got some perfume, love, etc. the body shop. Make sure there's nothing expensive, oil treatment. Looks like just average stuff. Throw it over here. This bag. Hey look, we always need this. Thing of tape, an oil filter. And well, important tax record for 2018. Hmm. What was going on in here, guys? Now look, sweet, $50,000. Boom, I wish. All right, purple bag. Ooh, heavy. <gasps> Something good. Ooh, a laptop. Think pad. Think pads too, aren't they the good ones? Yeah, Lenovo is usually more expensive. Yeah, think pads are all right. Which side is it open on? Am I stupid? Over uh, here. No, oh, yeah, I'm stupid. That's okay. Let's see. <laughs> this is a. Uh, it doesn't tell me. Intel. Huh? It doesn't mm, tell me. T500 Lenovo. Yeah, but I don't see no. It usually should have like the processor and yeah. the operating system, but. You gotta look it up. You see anything on the back? Product key. No, it doesn't. Hmm, that could be worth a lot more than we pay for the unit or it could be cheap part laptop. I don't know. We'll have to find out. Let's see what else is in that bag though. What the laptop. Charger one? Yes. Yay! Charger for it, so we can check it. We'll just get home and tell Baby Jeebus this. So we found a laptop. <laughs> be restored and factory ready to go in about five minutes. So let's hope it's a nice one. So we got a box of books here. Trump and Bill's anchor. Think big and well, I can't say the rest of that, but hey man, good, good advice. Uh, new perspective on our lives with compassion animal, or companion, companion animals. Love and friendship. Isn't that like one of those old books? I feel like I've heard that title like a hundred times before. Let's see how old this is. Hmm. I don't see a date. A copyright 1993. Good year. Nah, almost. Ugh. Green eggs and ham. Oh. oh, well. <laughs> well, what is this? A shirt? That is just a shirt. Meh. Well, let's see what's in this box. Book, mist. Oh, DVD. All right. I don't think that's a DVD, friend. Don't think so. But they sound like they're in there. Yeah. So. A box of DVDs, probably a good, I don't know, 15 bucks for those. Let's see what's in this one. What is this, actually? Ooh, interesting. Jewelry box. Ooh, no, what? Randomness. Two. Oh, it's from God, nice. I'm never going to Christmas card from God. <laughs> but it's in there. We got an angel. What is this? 1946 Wee Back Penny. Before anybody goes crazy, guys, it's just a joke. Relax. A little angel. Um, index cards. There's a holy Bible. Let's skim through it. Like everyone always tells me, oh, there's something in it. Hey, oh, it? Card. Every sip is more rewarding. Thank you. This is Pete's coffee. Notes. A feather. There's a lot in this one. There's like everything except money. <laughs> Feather. Who put the feather in there? Um, I'm pretty sure I know what this is. Alright. Oh no, never mind. I thought that was a grinder. This is that. Well. This is that. Yeah, it is. I'm always right when I say that. Nickel. I I don't really know. But that was kind of a random interesting box. Let's see what we got in this box too. These are, huh, I don't think there's going to be pictures, but happiness and destiny. Hmm. I like it. Now let's see what else we got in here. Ooh, that is a jewelry box. It didn't look like jewelry in it. There's <laughs> nuts. Oh boy. And, I don't know. I just, I don't know what to say. 
Oh gosh, do I open the sock? Yeah. Something's in the sock. It's classic, never mind. These are Solar Comfort. Well, this is just, I don't even know what, random paperwork. Hey, this is a foam box. What are all these, by the way? Candles. Half burn candle, more than half burn candle. It's got some weight to it. 830, I don't even know what that is. Nothing. Cheap. Cheap foam box. And just very, very random things, to say the least. We will definitely let you in on some of this stuff during the recap. Before we even get into the recap of this video, you guys gotta make sure you go down into the description of this video, click the link for our live auction. It's already scheduled for this Saturday. And click that little bell icon that says a set of reminder and do it now because we're gonna have epic stuff up for auction this weekend. I'm talking Michael Jordan autographs. I'm talking war military weapons. I'm talking jewelry. I'm talking coins. I'm talking, ah. A lot of stuff I wasn't planning on selling that I've been kind of hoarding from units. I just figured I'm going to go ahead and just sell it off and let you guys get it and make your own money too. Because we're never going to get this stuff done. And you know what? I want everyone else to make money too. So 2 p.m. Pacific time, 5 p.m. Eastern time, and wherever you are in the middle, figure out what time because you got to be there. It's going to be more epic than last time. But anyway, enough of that. Let's get into the okay. unit. Before we talk about the items in this unit, we want to talk about a little bit of what we figured out from the backstory. So when we were going into some of this stuff in more detail, there was like the weirdest things that we were finding in bags. Like there was legitly three bags that were just broken sticks off of trees, like just <laughs> bags full of sticks. And then there was like pill bottles with like little ripped up pieces of paper and like there's no pills yeah. in them, it's just like ripped up paper. Hordes of like the Pete's Coffee and Starbucks like um, heat covers or whatever for coffees just weird thing really weird <laughs> thing so of course we wanted to look more into this and we found medications for like a plethora of mental disorders that this person was suffering from like bipolar disorder schizophrenia schizophrenia and just... i don't know what the difference is with bipolar one technically uh, like i said i don't know what the difference is and i think the medicine started like arms like repredidone or something like that so. Something like that, yeah, something crazy. But that's one of the biggest causes I see in storage units. Other than people being arrested and just falling on bad times, it seems like mental illness is definitely something else that makes a lot of people lose their storage units. Yeah. And usually they don't have much valuable stuff in it, but it's just like set to, I guess maybe the sticks were sentimental. I don't know, but it was just, every time I find really weird stuff like that, I always, I have to figure out why. Because well, like I said, a normal person won't store three bags of sticks. That's not normal. So, I guess let's give talk about the laptop first. I'm going to give you the good news and the bad news. Okay. The good news of the laptop. It cuts on fine. It's not password protecting, so it does not have to be restored. Good Let news. Let me open it. Boom. And there's no cracks or anything oh. like that. And it was actually charged. You believe that? We didn't have to charge it. But that's where the good news ends. Bad news, it's an old model. It's got Windows 7 on it. It's got a Core 2 processor, Dang. like 2 gigs of RAM and like 120 gig hard drive. It's like... Worth 50 bucks on eBay, so that's where our other good news ends. This is a right? random question. Would you rather get good news or bad news first? Uh, bad news first. You want yeah. to end on a good note. Bad news you first. Gotta so why do you get good news first? I don't know. Bad. Oh, bad sorry. news always comes first. You end on a good note. True. One of the only things we found in the unit that we didn't show on there is this right here, which looks like a set of Nike. I think, I think it's football kids. pants, football legs. That's what it looks like to me. Yeah, right definitely there. Definitely kids. Yeah, definitely kids. But still. it's brand new with the tag from Nike, 45 bucks. So they're still going for about $30 on eBay right there. So we got that brand new. And then we got this whole freaking crate. Yeah, this whole crate was literally, there was numerous bags from Dollar Tree. So we have a buttload of frames. We have some ribbon. We have some pens. Everything. Markers, binder things, a pair of socks, some cards. Yeah. I mean, just literally. Just literally probably like, what, $100 worth of just stuff. Brand new stuff, Basically. never used. Basically. So we're literally, what, just dollar that out of the flea market? Yeah. I mean, whatever. I mean, it's all brand new, so we can still sell it for a dollar, even though it came mm -hmm. from Dollar Tree. So realistically, it's not like a very good, we still have a box of DVDs too, we still have a box of books. I mean, I think when it's all said and done, we'll probably maybe make like 200 bucks on a unit, which isn't great. It's not bad. It's at least a double, 
But at this time, this stupid quarantine, I just, we need I don't units. care. I needed to get out of the house. <laughs> it's been like, we were talking about this, like one day in and I'm going insane already. I cannot stay, stay in the house. I can't do it. I'm just not that type of person that can sit around and do nothing for an extended period of time. I go crazy very fast. So very limited storage units right now. Most facilities are closing. Most live auctions have already canceled like weeks in advance. So we're really going to have to kind of just see what happens at this point. Because By the way, did we get the clip of the storage facility? I did get a clip of the storage facility. Okay. Check this out. <laughs> Guys, not even joking. You have to talk to them and do clipboards through a mail slot. They will not even open the door. What is this, fallout? Gosh, the media can really manipulate people. That's how crazy it is right now, guys. Yeah, it's kind of Let me just get this out there. <laughs> My opinion, if you don't like it, I don't care. It's whatever, you have your own, everyone has their own. If you're older or you have a compromised immune system, yes, take extra precaution and try not to go out in public. It's just a freaking super flu. That's really what it is. You don't need 10 years of toilet paper. You don't need 60 years worth of hand sanitizer. You're gonna be fine. You really are. It's not that scary. You don't gotta look like you're in fallout coming out of a vault every time you go to the grocery store. You don't have to. It's gonna be okay. I've just never seen so much panic in people. It's crazy. You're, yeah. you're alright, guys. Relax. Definitely interesting to see. It's crazy. Just relax. It's all going to be okay. I guarantee you, next month or by May, we forgot this ever happened. It was never a thing. 100% guaranteed. I, I bet anything I have. Like, I hope. They just, Let's all hope. They, just, <laughs> they want you to be scared and terrified. That's all right. what they're doing. Anyway, guys, enough going on about this. I'm just sick and tired of hearing it. I'm sure you agree with me. Every time you yes. cut on any channel, I'm I mean, like, guess what? Done, Let's go to, done with Facebook. Let's go to Google. <laughs> Bam. Let's go to Facebook. Bam. Go on YouTube. Bam. I'm just... Uh, it's... I'm sick of it. Okay, okay. All Guys, right. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave the video a like. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, peace out.